Hello guys, I'm Delifix. Welcome to X4 Reemergence. So I've been exploring mainly off camera, of course. Uh, and I made my way through the Terran sectors. Uh, okay. There is, of course, this uh, the Xenon K that is going to be having a very, very, very bad day. Not because I'm joining, of course. Um, but they, he's going to get barraged. Oh my god, there's so many ships in there. Let's pause. And yeah, love that. There is the carrier, the uh, Tokyo, that is having a lot of fighters launched towards this. Uh, this almost poor bastard. Um, <laughs> Engine. Not really. I know. I know. Uh, we're going to be um, at least trying to hit a few times. It won't do anything for us. At least I don't think... Oh, we need to get the heck out of here. 22% in hull. So, where I would like to go is what they call a restricted territory. And I kind of cannot remember if the first uh, system after uh, the asteroid belt well done, is, everyone. is open for us. Return to base. Awesome. So there is a uh, there is a definitely a gate uh, somewhere in that vicinity. Can't really. Can I? I think it's over there, right over there. Yeah, that's where I. No, actually, no, that's not one. That 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 goes to a different area. Wait, what's that? Oh, I love the zoom function so damn badly. Wait, there's something over there. Oh yeah, that's it. That's the Taladi ship who's been ordered to uh, vacate the area. So that that's going to be my goal because the reason for that is I've not found um, anything but two trading stations and an equipment dock. And I still want to find the Terran shipyard and wharf. Uh, also, also, side note, uh, all of these stations are now having five transport ships and the reason for that is i think it is time that we open up the factories now not all of them have a a lot of dead stock some of them actually do like this graphene uh and, and well that, that that's basically i think it maybe the solar power plant yeah of course the solar power plant I would like to start using the trading station as, as more of a distribution station that can distribute wares between stations. That's why we now have only two uh, ships assigned towards the trading station. I'm hoping that this is going to be a good call. I don't really know if that is going to be it. But we are going to. So I'm going to be locking these up for just to trade with my own faction and let's restrict this to private now should everything should be set to private this needs to go well no we can actually buy that that's a good thing the other thing i need to turn off like energy cells uh automatic pricing can be on uh, this can be on and we will sell at nine so it's going to be less interesting for my own ships uh, to uh, trade with uh, the stations surrounding that. Uh, let me quickly start doing that. Okay, with that out of the way, the only, only things that I left untouched are the advanced schematics. We are still uh, buying them unrestricted. Uh, the labor union contracts, uh, as well as the military schematics. Uh, these are products that I am not yet producing myself. So why this station? Uh, because I've been thinking about expanding the network a tiny bit. It has no value right now. Eventually it will, once we have trading licenses. Once we have trading licenses, uh, I'm just going to be placing, I think like every three jumps, a bit of a trading station. So that will go uh, one, two, uh, three. That would be a Pious Mist 2. 
And then the other way is going to be one, two, uh, three is silent witness one. That will leave one, two, three, four jumps in this vicinity. Uh, where we'll end up doing another one. Maybe we can do... F f I'm not sure yet. Uh, like I said, it doesn't matter right now. What I do need to do is still make sure that we are not buying. So we definitely are going to be setting the stations to be uh, restricted as a trade to private. Because I want that to happen. Uh, this can now be turned off. Uh, this can be turned off as well as the silicon can be turned off. But this is going to be auto priced. No restriction. My ships will start hunting for uh, sellers. Uh, we'll level up the managers uh, just going back to i think how everyone sets their stations uh, apart from me because i usually definitely route all of them but i i just want to make sure that i'm not losing money because i'm an idiot so yeah i'll uh, i'll quickly set up all of these then we'll check out if i'm going to be shot at the second i enter uh another terran sector if i get shot at then well, we're going to go towards a Antigen station and we are going to buy multiple licenses so we can start mass producing. I'm hoping stations. That That's the goal, but I don't have the money for that. So we need to make a so, I'm sort of a pit stop into commodities that we know we can either mass produce or we can... Why is there a quantum tubes in here? Oh, he is buying. Yeah, he's buying. I love to see that. That's that's great. Um, anyways, you get the drift. Eventually, all of these will have massive dogs, etc., uh, etc. Et Terran security to approaching vessel. You are approaching a restricted area. Please divert your course immediately. Um, I'm going to Terran assume. Terran security to trespassing vessel. You are on course to enter secure space. We insist that you change course immediately or face military action. Okay, well, we don't want that. Definitely not. What's that? Not a station. So, unfortunately, I think I'm unable to show you um, the ships right now. Uh, what I can do is uh, once we go towards... Um, Engaged. That particular uh, faction representative. We're going to be buying some of the uh, blueprints. Now we have silicon wafers. Uh, what else can we get? Let's take a look. Where's... If I want to go... Okay, well I had a massive, massive... Like, I don't know what my brain was doing, but it wasn't thinking. So... With the silicon that we are producing, we can go into microchips. The quantum tubes we have, the antimatter cells. Do we have those antimatter cells? Entering Which is system. basically Avoid. energy hydrogen. Um, if I don't, we go into that as well as the microchips. Then the next step is going to be um, the claytronics, which I think is going to be extremely expensive. Now, with the entire idea of just routing from this station, it is possible to actually supply this base. So, say we want to do production hacking. This will allow you to gain blueprints by scanning leaks on certain modules. I think we want to go smart chips and advanced electronics. We have the graphene, we have the energy. So, advanced electronics and smart chips would be the, a right action. Uh, advanced electronics. System. We no will oil. need microchips. We have the quantum tubes. And the other one was the smart chips. We have the silicon wafers. Okay, wow. Oh, we are very close then. Smart chips, microchips... Advanced electronics. 
I know I said that I wanted to go towards missile stuff, but if if I need to start paying large quantities, autopilot disengage. Then I might as well just make sure I can build bases, so we don't need all of this money uh, going into the economy. Now this this can go. The others they will start making profit, as you can see over here. So they will slowly build up their their wallets and that's fine that, that's perfectly fine okay uh we should be at the faction representative now i was thinking about getting myself a medium ship and then um i remembered me going into that one system and i got just one shotted by a bunch of cock and i was like yeah maybe maybe just maybe Maybe just maybe we should go towards a large ship. To oh, you are joking. These guys are getting harassed so badly. Uh, helium refinery 2. You. Who is harassing you? I think he might be in the other sector. Let's see what happens. Keep this one open. Remove that. Oh, there we go. Skill play Marauder. Yeah, I'm starting to think. Ooh, will he shoot him? That's a scout. He's faster though. No, he can't. He can't. We do need to do something about that, though. At some point, we do need to get some escorts. Okay, let's um, let's quickly stop wasting time. Granted. Go over here because uh, why not? I'm considering buying uh, to dock. the dock license to trade with the Argon Federation. Uh, right now, we're still relying upon satellites, and we don't have all of the bases covered. And I've been told to present you with an opportunity to become a member. If you're interested, come find me. Uh, wait, you have a trading thing in here? Yeah, trading guild. Okay, we can actually join them. That's fine. Maybe we'll get some good missions from them. Maybe we should actually go. Hello. And get ourselves a bit of a, a, a trade ship. Let's get the rank. Great interest. And wanted to reward you for it. I'm pleased to present you with a new rank amongst our organization. Of course, this rank comes with great benefits. These benefits are tied to the rank, so if you lose the rank, the benefits go too. But with your record, I'm sure we don't have to worry about that. I hope you find these rewards fitting to the work you've done and make the most of them. Once again, I thank you for your efforts. We look forward to working with you more in the future. Good luck out there. Uh huh. Great. Um. Anyways, let's take a look. Modules, production, uh, advanced electronics. Oh, we can't do that over here. Okay, we we can do that with the Argon Federation. We need microchips, which apparently I I got. My God, I've I've don't have the smart chips though. Oh, that's just fantastic. That's just fantastic. Good luck. Um, out there. Let's go. Before we actually leave, let's join the Trade Federation. And then we'll uh, head over to the Argon Federation uh, while we construct. Ah, yeah. I'm glad you came. Yeah, our me too, man. Currently seeking to increase our presence in the market. I'm to just seeking money. We're Basically. offering membership to a select number of trusted individuals. This is a one-time investment, after which you will have access to a Wait, number of I need of to pay lessons. you? <sighs> Fine. Great. I'll update our database right away. You should be able to see jobs on offer in the areas where we operate. We expect good things from you. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's fantastic. That's um, okay, let's go. Uh, let's unlock. Uh, we'll pause. We're going to be setting course for the Argon Faction representative. Uh, well, on pausing, we are going to be needing... Uh, what do we again, need again for the uh, microchips? Micro. 
microchips. Silicon and energy. Advanced uh, schematic. Silicon and and autopilot. Engage. Okay, where's my silicon base? That's over here. One, two. My energy guy is over there, and he's a two star. So I'm going to assume. Let's take a look. Power plant uh, information. Two star. Graphene. Uh, actually, silicon. Three star. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, we're going to be building it right over here. I also need to in take a look at this accelerator. It's been there, and I've not done anything with it. it feels kind of stupid that I haven't. Anyways. Uh, create new plot. Plot you open right over there. So... Oh, of course. Entering system. The void. Yeah. Uh, let's take a look. It doesn't really matter. I don't have large ships yet. Uh, definitely don't want to pause. Uh, we want... At least one of these. I know people hate me for not using space or shift. But my problem with shift is that it goes by steps of 60 and not by 45, 90 and so on, so on. So yeah, I kind of hate that. That's my reason for not using shift. For those of you who are wondering. Uh, let's get a large container. Can we do it a bit differently? Because I think... Yeah, these are quite massive. It has uh, one or two points. Seems like one connection point. If I want that over there... We can still utilize this. Okay, so this could go there. Like so. Then... Entering First connection. System. Second contact. Hmm. Then I want it differently. Then I need to change that. I don't want it like this anymore. You go there. You can go like this. And then you can f go right. Like so. I think we need a space in between. And we can do the same thing. Like so. There we go. That's four modules, right off the bat. That's that's going to be expensive, guys. It will be. Uh, look at that. 10.6 million just to get this done. Now, we need claytronics, we need energy cells, and we need a bunch of it. Uh, unfortunately, yeah, the claytronics is going to be expensive. It's going to be more expensive than anything we have done so far. Uh, let's get the Antigon Builder. I still think that this is going to be a very valid next step, step. So I'm definitely going to be making that investment. But look at this. Look, look in, just like that, it's done. Just like that. Now, all we need is silicon. And don't forget, we also will require uh, seven ships. Seven medium ships, because four, five has been the number we have been using, and yeah, I do want to actually do the same thing, and just eventually we'll find out where the problems are. Uh, before we go there, because I'd, I'm out of cash, we're going to be visiting this accelerator, because it is bugging me, and hopefully my changes towards uh, my own faction, once this starts working, uh, will be enough to actually make me a good amount of profits. These guys are going to be selling, so I'm going to assume yes, but what's the problem with these guys? 
Uh, we're going to be... Actually, that's a lot, though. These guys are not keeping up at all. I, I did assign a few more ships. Uh, I definitely want to keep a eye on the economy of that one station. Okay. Autopilot disengaged. There are ships going through. So, I'm going to assume it's not going to lead... Entering into Xenon systems. Seven. My god, there's an entire system over here that I didn't even know about. Well, I, I knew about it. I just didn't care enough to actually take a visit. Which is kind of stupid. Yeah, we have ships for that, so we're not going to be bothering. Uh, we'll head over towards the faction representative, and I'll meet you guys there. Okay, so we actually made it towards the station. Uh, let's quickly go and check out the faction representative. Uh, what I need to know is how expensive is going to be the trading license. I'm going to assume it's going to be costing me about um, 10 million. Yeah, that's, that's quite harsh. But is it worth it? That, that's going to be the next question. Good luck out Let's there. quickly take a look. How expensive is going to be the advanced electrons? Three and a half million. And the... Was it anti matter cells? No, no, smart chips. Where the actual... I'm blind. Okay, my brain is doing that thing again, where I am unable to find smart chips. Well, this has me confused. I didn't buy them, right? Good luck out there. What the actual... They're universal. Okay, I'm, I'm losing it. Absolutely losing it. License. No, not licenses. Go away. There. Blueprints. Modules. Production. Yeah, this has me confused. How, how do these guys make electronics? You are able to make electronics. Yes, you are. Is there an argon way of making claytronics? It's antimatter cell. How do I? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm really losing my brain here, guys. I'm. I think I need more sleep. We were looking into this. This will allow smart you chips. Blueprint. By scanning leaks on certain modules. That's great, I know. Okay, well, uh, I guess they just don't sell them to me. That's it makes perfect sense. Somewhere. Because what I need to consult my Excel sheet for a second. Um what does what makes use of smart chips? Uh, where are you? Uh, I don't think actually does any nothing. Okay. An end product. I never, I never knew 
that the Argon Federation didn't have him. <laughs> okay, wow, this is really throwing me up. Let me get a moment to actually get my barons again. <laughs> this is so stupid. Yeah, the, so the Argon Federation has a, a, a quite a need for them. Yet, they only sell them with the trading station, which is absolutely uh, insane. Uh, in, in my uh, unprofessional opinion. Uh, wow. Uh, that means that I will most likely need to find myself a... Who would sell them to me? Uh, I have to go back to the Antigon and just see if I can do some missions. This is so stupid. Maybe the Taladi. Um, I'll, I'll go fly around, see if I can find them, and... If I can actually buy them. Because apparently they're a, they're a high-tech product. So I would have to have a plus 20 relation. If that is the case, then this is this is not going to work. I might as well just focus on Claytronics. What would I need for that? Before I leave. Antimatter cells. That's it. Okay, let's get the antimatter cells. And, and I can actually go, go sulk in a corner because I can't find this. Damn smart chips, apparently. Uh, antimatter cell production. Let's buy that. Good luck out there. Yeah. I, I, no, this is... Nah. <laughs> the, the game is absolutely just, for, just... Just absolutely messing around with me. They're not. Good okay, whatever. Um, fine, fine. I'll, I'll just, just I'll bring my business elsewhere. Uh, let's unlock. So, um, in that moment where I'm just absolutely losing my brain, the whole part factory actually made three million, and it, they're starting to transfer. I'm not going to be touching that money. The graphene factory made one point five. And yeah, that that's basically it. Well, it it will it will come to us. It will come to us. We could also just get the license and get over with. I was asked to drop my car. Oh, you're joking. We need to do something about pirates. Silicon refinery. I think it was five. Was it five? It was five. You know what? I'm going there. I'm I'm sick and tired of this. We're heading over there. Okay, well, I'm actually heading over that. Uh, this is going to be the anti-matter factory. Uh, four modules. Again, uh, small liquid storage, large container storage. Uh, Two million. And let us quickly assign a Taladi freighter because this Entering is going contact. to be in the same system as my helium refinery. There is Autopilot. quite a Disengage. decent amount this is actually not the right system. Why can I not get the right system? Because I am in the wrong build building menu. Uh, there you go. Uh, 7.8 thousand K. So I'm going to send that 7.8 million hydrogen. Uh, it, it's it, it's the, uh, the most I could find in a free jump range. Of course, then I will click somewhere and you instantly see like... Massive amount. No, there isn't. We, I, I'm sick and tired, and I want to find pirates. I want to find pirates. Where am I? Because I feel like shooting stuff. Because I need something to preoccupy my brain. Halt. We will be scanning your inventory. Oh, great. Um. Okay, I should be safe. While also going to the Antigon. Found nothing. You can go. Let's go back to the Antigon guy. I could set up an alarm. That if. Something with the Marauder attack. Pops up anywhere. I'll get like an alert. But if, if there's too many of them. We're, we're not going to be enjoying that. Wait what? What? Wait, the microchip factory? 
Is that that fast? I completely forgot. If that's true. Wow! <laughs> Hell yeah, I love that. Yeah, I'll do that any time of the, of the week. Let's pause. I completely forgot that the uh, building in this uh, amazing mod pack is insane. Um, overview. We want the settings up the way I want them to be. That means I want trade restrictions set to private. And the numbers. The numbers. Oh, I need my calculator because I cannot do that at the top of my head. I still think this it's a mass a missed opportunity from Egosoft to just get a faction sheet about the entire faction. I know nothing relating with me calculating stuff, but it just breaks my brain. Breaks my brain. Uh times four times two. So we're gonna be buying a whopping amount. 2400. Uh, this can all stay the same because it's private. Next up is going to be silicon wafers. Now we need to make sure that we can actually uh, get the silicon wafer production up. But we will need 9,600. Like so. And at the schematics... Times four times two, four hundred and thirty-two. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, definitely private pricing amount. It's all fine. Will leave me a lot of room for this. Now this could go unrestricted. We're going to be getting ourselves a manager. So we don't have any... Got this entire factory set up. Those are captains. I don't want to mess around with captains. You are going to be working here as a manager. Okay, how much money can I squeeze out of my system? Out of my station, sir? You... Um, wait, there's a small problem I have here. This station will need money. And the reason for that is they are buying the schematics. The advanced ones as well as the military and the union have already run out. So kind of a mistake on my part. I should definitely have made sure that there was money. You don't need that cash. Don't need money. You kind of do need that money. You don't. And what do you have? Nothing. Ah. Okay, so we said we needed five. Uh, seven ships. Can we buy those? Low presets. Um, actually need tra- Oh, wait. I might actually have bought a few ships with combat engines. That's a mistake. Well, we'll buy five then. Actually, we can... No way. No. Okay. Five. That's where we're starting with. Um, while I actually head back towards the uh, faction representative, I need to bloody find those ships that I kind of messed up. Okay. Apparently, my, uh, my Pioneer Explorer is done, which is uh, definitely interesting. So... Where shall we send it? I don't want to send them towards Terran uh, territory. I don't think I have all of them. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten systems. I think there might be a bit more than that. Uh, hiding here and there. Uh, but there is a gate over here that might still need some exploration. Uh, it's funny though that actually one of the ships is now done. I think this is going to be like part 12. Entering uh, system, Antigone It doesn't Memorial. really show me my total time, which is, um... Interesting. Well, I spent... 14 and a half hours controlling a ship. Haven't used SATA at all, and I won't. I don't like SATA. 
It's kind of weird and I cannot see my total time. Wait, I can? Uh, which one is it? Oh, it's a day! Wow! Uh, well, I'm, I'm going two hours for one episode, guys. Yeah, and you guys are wondering why it takes some time. Uh, well, the economy in this game is amazing. In this mod pack, I should say, and not the game. The one thing is uh, ships are expensive and there's a lot going on, a lot going on. And I definitely don't want to lose... Ah, uh, my ships already lost one of these ones. Uh, I had to cheat to actually get it back. Basically, it's just, um... Successfully docked. You know... Get back uh, into a previous safe. Let's get up. So, while... I was traveling here, while I was completely shocked still, I'm in... I'm in shock that... The... Argon Federation doesn't have the... A smart chip blueprint. I, I, I'm, I'm going to consider just, just having the episode name be like that, smart chips, because I, that really messed me up. Smart chip production. Yeah, there we go. Cost absolutely nothing. The Antigon sells them. <laughs> the Argon, uh, the Argon Federation doesn't. It's so weird. I have to go back and, and I just good luck out there. Plus twenty is going to be so annoying. Uh, well, there is an option for me, and that's doing the trade guild, seeing if there's some easy, uh, easy missions, number of potential dangerous situations. I'm not sure if I can, and we get the vindicator. Okay, sounds like a Star Wars thing, but that's that's fine. Uh, I'll look into these, see if we can find some things to do, like item recovery. Uh, laser tower placement doesn't sound too difficult. We only need to uh, deploy one laser tower. That, that That's doable. And I'll definitely do that in my own time. Now, I was also making a sentence about in my time. I added five ships to the factory. They're starting to get the materials in. Uh, we can actually get 8k back, which is great. I also bought these two ships who are going to be um, microchip one and the microchip. I was asked to drop my. Oh, you guys, come on. Two. I'll add microchips in here. Confirm that. Buy offer, private, as well as the sell offer. Going to be private. Uh, these will eventually distribute stuff. That that's the entire idea behind it. The uh, anti meta cells will be in here as well, and. Yeah, <laughs> this really messed me up so badly. I'm absolutely confused, guys. Uh, anyways, um, I'll, I'll be signing off. I uh, hope you still enjoyed the episode. Uh, let me know what you think about the Argon Federation not having... Um, just not having smart chips. Maybe it's me. It, it, it can definitely be me. But I would like to know why. Why do they not have it? Is it considered illegal? No. They're just incapable of producing smart chips, apparently. <laughs> well, anyways, guys, thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.